Security was tight at the Monarch Gala. You took quite a risk walking into the lion's den. If we were going to kidnap Dr. Amaral, then we needed to do it from the inside. Beth Wilder. You were quick to trust her. We had common interests. Is that all you had? It's all we needed. Thanks for showing up. Here, I thought this was gonna be a rescue. Right, there's a story here. You know a guy called Hatch? Serene's right-hand man. He was here. He gave me this big speech about how he wants to take down Paul. I hope you said no. I didn't trust him for a second. He set me loose anyways, told me to wait for an opening. I just gave you one. Appreciate it. What's it look like out there? I think you're secure. Everyone's concentrating on the party. So far, your crazy plan's working. And Dr. Emerald? I don't have a fix on her. She's either at the party or at her office at the R&D facility here on the island. I'll scout out the party. So you're gonna sip champagne while I break into a high security installation? It's like you got this all figured out. I'll save you a cocktail, weenie. Oh, well, in that case. My cover isn't gonna survive the night, but it'll last a little longer, so you can't walk out the front door with me. This is the quickest way to the R&D facility. I disabled the security at the back door, but there'll be guards. Contact me when you're clear. And Jack, you know what's at stake here. This can't be about revenge. I'm not here for Paul. Hey! He's escaping! will hurt in the morning. My powers were growing. I was learning to control them better. That felt good. Hey Beth, I'm clear. What's next? You'll see a radar tower up ahead soon. Let me know when you get inside. <laughs> Oh, you could have warned me about that one, Beth. Okay, how am I getting to that radar tower? <sighs> Up you go. It was just our people there. We can spin it. Time felt broken here. The timeline of the old cannon felt loose. I could shift it around. Smart place to aim the cannon, guys. I've been thinking. Monarch projections say these stutters are getting more frequent. If one hits while we're grabbing Dr. Amaral... He'll be frozen. Yeah, I know. It's a risk. Monarch specialist troopers have the stutterproof gear. I bet Dr. Amaral would have that in her office, too. I'll keep an eye out. Yeah.
Thanks, Beth. Beth? I'm at the radar tower. Where's the lab? Below your feet. It's all top secret. The elevator inside will take you down. Whoa, seriously? What is this, a Bond villain lair? <laughs> you have no idea. Just don't fall into the shark tank. Beth, I'm about to take the elevator. I see Paul's still fond of his own voice. Yeah, he's talking about his survival plan. Crowd's eating it up. The device drained my powers. We refer to it as a chronon dampener. Serene ordered Hatch to kill me because he didn't want to put his plan at risk. But seeing the scale of that facility, I started realizing just how deep that plan went. It made me wonder. Time was ending. What was it all for?
Which way is Amaron's office? This isn't the usual employee route. <clears throat> Dr. Amaral's office must be close. Nobody here knows about the mess I made on the way in. <sighs> nice job, Beth. That's Emma's office. That there looks like what Beth wanted. Oh, shit. Emma's at the party. The stutter won't last. I better find a way out of here and get to the party. Quite expensive piece of tech you stole. Bill me. I knew Beth's cover wouldn't last long. Had to get it to her at the party before it was too late. <laughs> 